Good morning. Good morning. Wait. Good, good morning, teacher, please. Good morning. Had your breakfast? Yes. yes. Wow, very good. Yeah. Okay. Can you see? Yes or no? Yes. Yes. Very good. Hi, Nicha. Nicha is here. Who else? Mm. Ten. Okay, ten is already here. Okay. So we are going to start now. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, teacher. Please. How are you today? I'm fine. Thank you. And you? I am doing good. Okay. So today we are going to learn about science. Okay. So last time we learned about living and non-living things right yes or no yes 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 now who can who can give me some example of living things by the way what is living things living things power me see it okay so you can give me an example of living things sing me me sing me uh living things example example Sing me shirit. Ah, okay. Example, I will give first. A uh, dog. Living thing. Oh yes, living thing. So give me an example of living things. Flowers. Ah, flowers. Yes, very good. What else? Yes, flowers. Trees. Okay, what else? Hmm? What else? Trees, flowers, dog. What else? Give me some example. Huh? Cat. Cat. Okay, that's right. Cat. Huh? Yes, very good. What else? Hat. Human. Human. Okay. Human, like a children, like mother, father. Human means people. Yes, very good. Now let's go to our non-living things. Non-living things, Pawa. Okay, so who can give me an example of non-living things? Give me an example. Huh? Non-living things, I will give first. Uh, yes, sharpener. What else? Elisa. Eraser, very good. What else? House. House. Okay. What else? 
Eraser, house, sharpener. What else? Ruler. Ruler. Okay. And then? Book. Books. Okay, so those are an example of leaving things and not leaving things. Okay, let's proceed. Okay, so these are what we learned last time. Okay, so last time we talked about non living things are not able to. So, non living things not able to eat, not able to drink, not able to breathe, not able to grow their own bodies not able to move by themselves okay and okay. not able to produce okay why living things they can eat they can drink they can breathe they can grow their own babies and move by themselves okay so this morning Okay, so this morning, okay, so there are lots of living things in the world. Uh, kindly turn off your microphone, please. You listen to teacher first. Okay, there are lots of living things in the world around us. People, animals, and plants are living things. So this is only an example. This is only a review, okay, of what we learned last time. So we have the animals. We have the monkey. We have this one. What is this again? Snake. Snake. This one. Horse. This one. Duck. 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 This one. Elephant. Elephant. How about this? Tiger. Tiger. How about this? Yeah, okay. So these are the example of living things which is or which are animals. Oh, we have also the fish and the frog. Okay. We have also this one. Oh, what is this? Flower. It's a flower. How about this? Tree. Tree. This one. Tree. It's also a tree. This one. Flower. It's a flower. How about this? Grass. It's a grass. So these are also an example of living things. Then we have these three girls. They are human so they are living things also okay so we are we have living things and non living things okay so this morning we have another topic that we need to discuss okay so you need to listen to teacher first okay so this morning, uh, listen, listen first. Okay, so this morning we are going to learn another topic. Okay, this is living, dead, or never alive. Okay, living means life, or there is a life. Dead means there is no life. Or never alive, never at once. It, it has life. Uh -huh. Turn off the microphone, please. Okay. So let's proceed so that you can understand very well of what our topic today. Okay. So we have different objects here. Okay. Who can name the objects here? Do you know what is this? This one. What is this? Oh. Yes, it's a boy. Okay, it's a boy. How about this? Do you know what is this? Hand. 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 What else? 
Okay. Spoon. What else? Glassy. Knife. Knife. Yes. It's an. It's a bread knife. Oh, what else? This one. This one. No. Fork. Fork. Very good. How about this? No way. No. Shell. Shell. Okay. Shell. This one. Dog. It's a dog. This one. Paper. It's a paper. This one. Huh? Water. It's a water bottle. This one. Three. Three. This one. Leaves. Or the dried leaves. This one. Computer. This one. Cup. Huh? It's a cup or maybe it's a glass, right? Okay. And okay, so then we have this. Okay. Now, how could you sort them in different groups? Okay, we have the boy, we have the utensils or what we use when we are going to eat. Then we have this one, the shell, when we have the dog, the paper, it's a paper. And then we have the water bottle, the tree, the dried leaves, the dried leaf, computer, the glass, and we are going to sort them out by group, okay? Okay. Now, look at the way the things have been grouped, okay? We have three groups already, okay? We have three groups. Wait. Okay, we have this one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We have 10 objects here. Now we are going to group these uh, 10 objects in three groups. Okay, so here we are. Okay, on the first group, we have, do you know what is this? Huh? Trees, this one. Trees. It's a boy. How about this? Stop. Okay, that is our group number one. Okay, in our group number two, we have the the shell decoration. Okay, it is a shell decoration. Okay, this one paper. Oh. A paper. This one. Okay, it is a dried leaf. Okay, dried already. Look at the color of the leaf. It's already brown. Okay, it's a dried leaf. How about this? In our group three, group three, faster. And we have the yachting cells, right? Then we have the glass or the pan. Ah, oh yes, you have that. Water, water bottle. bottle. This one. Yeah, Computer. Computer. Now look at the group or look each group very carefully. Okay. Okay. Now look at the words here. The first group. They are the things that are alive. When we see alive, there is life. Okay? When we see alive, there is life. Okay, so like the tree, the dog, and the boy. So they are alive or things that are alive or the things that has life. Okay, group number two. Things that were once alive. When we see once alive, people before it has life, but now it doesn't have, okay? Again, things that are alive means 
Now there is a life. Okay? Life. What is life? Like living, living things. Or it is still breathing. Okay? So, this one, things that were once alive, means before it has a life, but now it doesn't have a life. Okay? Because this one, the shell is, the shell came from the life of the seashells. This is only a decoration. Okay? The paper came from the trees. Okay? You can make a paper or the paper made from the trees. Leave this. It's already dry. Okay? It doesn't have a life anymore. It's because it is a dry leaf. Okay? So, meaning to say, these things were once alive. Once alive means before, before there is alive, but now it doesn't have. Okay? So, things that have never been, never been alive, like the spoon, fork, and knife, it doesn't have a life even before. Okay? Because these are the things. Mm -hmm. These, these are My material word. things. Okay? Me see it. This one. The long video. This one. The computer. It. it doesn't have a life. Even before. Mm -hmm. Even before. Mm -hmm. It doesn't mm -hmm. have. The water bottle. It doesn't have a life. Even before. Okay? Mm -hmm. While. Mm -hmm. The glass also doesn't have a life. Okay? Yes. 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 They still grow because it has a life. This person will eat, will drink because it is still alive. This dog can move, can run, okay, can drink water because it's still alive. But in number two, these are the things that once alive, meaning to say before it has a life, but now it doesn't have. Okay, like for example, the seashells, okay, the decoration. So these seashells came from the ocean, okay? So when the seashell is still alive, this is what... Uh, belong in this group but now it turned like this it is now a decoration but these things came from life or it has a life or it had a life before okay so like for example the paper the paper came from the trees okay so this paper came from the trees that's why there were ones alive, okay? So, because you cannot make a paper without a tree, okay? Next, the dried leaves. Now, it is a leaf. Or you will say, teacher, it's a leaf. It's a living thing. Yes, that's right. But now, it is already dry, okay? It dried up already. So, meaning to say, it doesn't have a life anymore. Look at the picture. It is dead. Okay? It is already dead. So that's why there is no light anymore. Because it's already dead. Although it is a leaf and it is it is a living thing. But it was before. Not now. It's already dead. Okay? So, but this one in group number three. Not even once. Never at once, there is no life. Okay? So, like for example, the fork, the spoon, and the knife. Does it have a life before? It doesn't have. Not even once. Okay? Not even once, 
wrist, spoon, fork, and knife, it doesn't move. Okay? This doesn't move. Computer. So, computer is made up of materials or a thing, which is non-living thing. Okay? That's why this object is never been alive. Never at once. Okay? Then, the water bottle. If you have this water bottle, it was or never been alive before. Okay? Same with the glass. Okay, the glass, it doesn't have a life. Never at once before, okay? Or before ah. these things doesn't I'm have a life, okay? Again, this one, you have these things. It's because before it came from a thing which is alive. But this one, no, no, okay? This one, no. This one is already dead, and this is came from the thing which is living thing. Okay, this one it doesn't have not even once. Okay, so now let's uh, let's continue. Okay, how do we know if something is alive? Okay, so teacher, how do we know that the thing has life? How do we know? Okay, so we are going to talk about this one. What do living things do? Okay? So, there are certain things all living things do. Okay? One, move. Okay? Like, you can dance, you can run. It's because you are a living thing. Okay? So think about how a flower will open up towards sunlight. Okay? It moves. Living things do, the one is move, okay? So that's why the butterfly can fly. It's because it is a living thing. And we say living things can move. Living things can move to the right. Living things can move to the left. Living things can run. Living things can swim. Any movement, living things can do that, okay? So next we have number two. Make more of their own type, okay? Meaning to say it can reproduce or it can have a baby, okay? Humans and other animals have babies. Birds will lay eggs, okay? So all the living things, animals, people, flowers, trees, they can make their own babies. Although it has a different process, but it's the same, they can make their own type, okay? So, human can make baby. The animals can make their own baby. For example, the dog. The dog can make a puppy, okay? That is a baby dog. And the flowers. The flowers from the trees, for example, it has a... It has a seed, so the seeds will fall down on the ground, and that seed will grow into a new plant, okay? So, that is the number two things living things can do. Number three, respond to the place they are in. So, if a plant is in a dark place, it will try to grow towards the light, okay? Like for example, if the plant, you are going to put the plant in a very, very dark place, the plant will make a way just to find sunlight, okay? So respond to the place they are in. For example, a human, a human or the children or if a kid, if you will put a kid inside a small place, the kid will cry because the kid cannot move. Okay, so every human thing or every living thing can respond to the place they are in. Okay, so that is the, what you call the stimuli. Okay, respond towards something is what you call stimuli. Only living thing can do that. So living thing has stimuli. Okay, next. Feed. So when we say feed, food. 
Okay. We'll see feed. You need food. Okay. So animals will eat food. Plants will suck up goodness from soil. Okay. So feed or living things needs to be feed. Like for example, human. You will die if you won't eat. Okay. So you need to eat. That's why you are growing. Next, grow. Okay, you are growing. So before when you are in kindergarten, you are just very, very small. Now you are in grade two. You can now run very fast. But before, during your kindergarten or during your anuban, you are just like a baby. You can move very slow. But now, you can move around inside the classroom very fast. It's because you are growing and you are now a big kid or a big children. Okay. Next is get rid of waste. That's why you, you go to the toilet. Oh, that's why you go to the toilet like every morning. It's because you are a living thing. You poop. Mm. You poop in the toilet. So like when humans go to the toilet, so you poop in the toilet. It's because you are a living thing. Okay? So it's because you are a living thing. So next, need oxygen. Okay, that's why you are breathing. That's why you need air. It's because you have a life, okay? So if you if you don't have an oxygen, then meaning to say you will die, okay? So, but a non-living thing cannot do this, okay? Non-living things cannot move. They cannot make more of their own type. They cannot respond to the place they are in or they don't have the stimuli then they cannot feed or you cannot feed them they cannot grow they cannot read of waste and they don't need oxygen okay so let's proceed okay so next is there are some things that used to be alive but aren't anymore paper is made from wood which comes from trees which were once alive. So this paper, so we have things Apple. that alive before. Apple. Yes, but now it's Apple. not. Okay, so like for example, Apple. the paper. Yes, very good. It's a paper. So the paper, this paper is made from wood. So the wood, the wood came from the trees so trees is a living thing so we need to say we're once alive meaning to say it's dead now so you cannot make a paper just to get the, the tree but it needs to be or you need to cut the trees and make it dead okay so that you can have the paper. So it's a process. Okay. That's why these things include in the things which wants a life. Okay. Another example. What living things can you think of? Okay. So remember, they need to be able to do all the seven, uh, seven things. So next is the fossils. Okay. So this is the fossil. So you told me that teacher, it is a seashell. All right, it's a seashell. So, but this is a fossils. Fossils are remain of animals that lived a long time ago, like the dinosaur. So nowadays, uh, we saw that there are fossils of dinosaurs. So, but long time ago, there were dinosaurs. So meaning to say, it belongs to the things which once alive, okay? So other things have never been alive. We know that have never been alive because they aren't made from something that could do all the seven things. So these are the fossils which belongs to the animals that lived a long time ago. When we say a long time ago, very, 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 like for example, like long, long, long time ago. Okay, so how many years passed? Okay, but it still remain 
it's because of the fossil. So that's why it includes to the things that have been alive. Okay, or things have things that lived before. Okay, so let's proceed. So decide whether each thing is live, living dead or has never been alive then click the to see if you were right so for example that what do you know what do you call this one this is what lion mm. lion. Yeah, good the lion so lion is what what do you think it is living dead or has never been alive yeah. dead ah, the lion yeah. ah. Oh, okay. Yeah, living. Okay. Yeah. okay, okay, it is living. Okay, let's see. Oi, wait, 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 wait. Okay, so lion belongs to the thing which is living, okay, or it has life, living. How about the flower? Uh, what do you call this one? It's a Flower. Flower. So flower oh. is what? Living, dead, or has never been alive? Living. Living. Very good. How about this one? What is this? Baby. It's a baby. baby. So baby is what? Living, dead, or has never been alive? Living. Huh? Living. Living. This one. What is this? Cable. Uh, cable. Cable. So table cable. is made of wood. Okay, it's a wooden table. Okay, living, dead, or has never been alive. Living. Ah, the living, living, dead, or has never been alive. Never been alive. Wood. So this table is made from wood. So meaning to say wood came from the trees. But now the trees was dead. That's why it became a wooden table. So it is dead. Okay? Dead. Because once these things were living or were or has a Live, okay. Uh, How about this one? Food, food, very good. Food. But it's a vegetable food. Oh, what do you think is this? Living, dead, or has never been alive? Food, yes. Huh? Dead, very good. Because they came from the plant, but this plant was dead already because it became a vegetable food so that's why it's dead okay this one flower okay so this one is a flower base so it is living dead or has never been alive living living Living, but it is a flower base now. So it is dead already. Yes, it's died. The flower died already. Okay, that is dead. So this one, what do you call this one? It's a, it's a pen. Very good. Pen is what? Living, dead, or has never been alive? Very good. Has never been alive. This one. What do you call this one? Ball. Very good. It's a ball. So ball is what? Living, dead, or has never been alive? Yes, never been alive. Because it's a thing. Never been alive. How about this? What is this? Ball. It's a bowl. Okay, bowl is what? Living, dead, or has never been alive? Never been alive. Very good. So, never been alive. So, let's group this 
things. Okay, so flower, uh, the baby, and the lion is, or they are living. They belong to living. We have the wooden table, which made from the wood, and wood came from the tree. So, so that is dead already. And we have the vegetable food. So vegetable food came from the plants or the vegetable plants. And we have the flower base, which has the leaves on it. In it. Okay, now these things belong to dead. Okay, because they were once alive or they were once has alive but now it was dead already okay so we have these three the ball and we have the bowl okay so they these are the things that have been alive not even once okay so Okay. So on your uh, on your activity, I will give you a Okay. Now on your activity, I will give you a worksheet on how to do it. Okay. So uh, you need to listen first. Wait. 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 For your activity, uh, you need to do this. Wait. Mm, wait, please. So that I can tell you how to do this thing. What they get up on that? Okay. Wait, please. Uh, I will send you the worksheets, the copy of your worksheets, and you need to do it. Okay. 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 For your worksheets, you need to do this one. Okay, can you see? Yes or no? Okay, so look around in your house or garden and list things you can find that are living, non-living, or once living. So this, which heading you think your things belongs under give reasons why decide it was living non-living or once living for example you will put a water bottle okay water bottle so you can write or you can draw up to you so water bottle is what it is non-living you will check put a check and then why because it is why why it is non living so you will draw or write up to you you will write water bottle you will write water bottle here and then you will why okay because it is non living thing okay you put it because it is non living thing okay then for example you will put or you will write book book is what book is living thing so living thing 